art is art is the the Christ light in each person made visible. It's the interior spark of the divine that finds expression in the world. It's the sacred made visible. I'm Lee Wagoner, the rector at St. Barnabas of the Valley in Cortez. I lead the worship here. I work with the community as we minister to our neighbors. And that's who I am. Oh, I think the space that's created among the people of St. Barnabas is so beautiful. We don't just imagine, we recognize and we serve Christ in all persons. We do that in many ways here. We do it through our worship. We do it through Grace's Kitchen, the soup kitchen. We do it with beauty and music and art. The idea, the idea for the art program. I visited one of the fellows who eats at Grace's Kitchen, went to his house, his apartment, and saw this incredible art he had done. He made the most amazing miniatures of the cliff dwellings at Mesa Verde. He carved tiny little stones out of stone. It took him years. And when he was telling me about it, he said, this is what saved him. It was what he did so that he didn't drink. His life was changed because he engaged with these art materials and this ability to express himself. And I thought, well, he can't be the only one. Art replaced uh, medications for uh, mental health. And so once I started doing art and playing music, I was able to get my mental health in better shape and uh, show people that no matter where you've been, you can uh, come back and be better than you were before. That's where the idea came from. Many people who maybe are struggling or who don't feel they have a voice, give them art materials and they can express themselves. You know, no matter what you want to do, if just one person starts it, somebody else is going to take a chance. So the ongoing work that happens at St. Barnabas carries over into some of us's lives. It's a way of saying, here I am, when you don't feel you're seen. Being able to uh, let myself out and be who I am and be accepted as part of the community, even though I'm pretty eccentric. This is where I get to express my uniqueness. I think they'll be able to be seen through their art. And maybe, maybe people who come to the reception will then recognize that these are real people. These aren't just bothers in their life. They're, they're our neighbors. When you walk in this door, the only thing that should be on your mind is love and trust, because that's where light comes from. And if you want to bring more light into your life and you want to quit being miserable, you have to go where there's light. I've become a lover of light. The more light I can collect, the happier I am. I know so many of the folks who come to eat at Grace's Kitchen and folks who are in our congregation who are alone or hurting, um, who wonder about the meaning in their lives, they're touched by beauty. They know that they matter, that what's, what's internal to them as it gets expressed through their participation in art and music um, is seen and valued. Art does all of that. Beauty does all of that. So that's why we've started this art project.